Hi, I'm Amanda Cavallaro, a developer advocate at Vonage. Let me walk you through sending your first SMS message with the Vonage SMS API in two minutes with just a few lines of code. The SMS message will be sent to a number. That can be a mobile number you already own, or you can also instantly provision a phone number from the Vonage dashboard. You have the option to use an existing number, purchase a new one, or even port your numbers. I will use a number from Great Britain I've previously purchased. I can find it on the menu on the left under Number Your Numbers. Let's curl an SMS message from the terminal using the Vonage SMS API. You'll need a few variables to do so. From the Vonage dashboard, you can navigate to the Getting Started with SMS page and you'll see a few variables provided. The number or brand which we will be sending the SMS message from, the text in the body of the text, the phone number we are sending the message to, and finally the Vonage API key and Vonage API secret that can be found on the Vonage dashboard. If we copy and paste the curl code snippet onto our terminal and press return, the message will be sent straight away to the provided number. You can search the logs to see the received message. On the left side of the Vonage dashboard, click on Logs, followed by SMS Logs. You'll be able to filter your SMS logs by a number of filters. For instance, in my example, I'm filtering by phone number and entering the GB phone number I currently purchased. There I can see the message that we've just sent. Let's send another message containing the text, testing SMS and send it from the terminal. If I navigate to the SMS logs, after we refresh the page, we can see the information about the message sent. In this tutorial, you learned how to send an SMS message with curl. That's not your only option. We have several programming languages, including Node, .NET, Java, PHP, Python, and Ruby. Go ahead and try our APIs.